Hello my lovelies and welcome to a Happy Meal video that just so happens to be landing on Wednesday. That is not because I forgot to do it on Monday or Tuesday or anything like that. It just so happens that no mail had arrived last week and I went to the post box on Monday no mail had arrived. Alas, uh, yesterday I went to the post box, yesterday being Tuesday, my time, at the time of recording, <laughs> and two lovely parcels made their way into my post box and you know what? I'm just impatient. I'm impatient. That's who I am. I, I love mail. We all know how much I love mail and I love sending mail and all, all the good stuff. And so I don't want to be... <laughs> I don't want to wait. I just want to open the stuff now because that's me and, you know, child at Christmas sort of thing. <laughs> so yes, welcome to a midweek edition of Happy Mail. Welcome, all of that good stuff. And yeah, this, uh, this past weekend was a bit rough anyway and yeah, everything was a bit crazy. If you follow the blog, my 30 days of zine reviews, well, it's no longer 30 days. <laughs> I tried to keep up, but I had a pretty major panic attack over the weekend. The kind and level of panic attack that required some recovery time. And sometimes you just, you have to do what you have to do. And yeah, I wasn't in the right state for reviewing scenes. I always want to make sure that I give everything that I review the same level of respect, time, and focus, and focus was just not going to happen. But the good news is <laughs> it's over and I'm feeling much better and I'm definitely feeling much better for having taken the time, whereas I would usually just try to power through and anything that I did would probably suffer for it. So yes, I'm very, very happy. <laughs> <laughs> that I actually decided to take the recovery time. But this video isn't about me and my panic attacks. <laughs> it is about mail and this week it is especially about mail that I am very impatient to open. Um, just before I get started, I wanted to say hello to new subscribers. <laughs> very cheeky. Hello, Mr. Swift. Hello, Ping. How you doing? I don't know if you want me to use your real names, but anyway, <laughs> nobody will know what I'm, who I'm talking about except you two. So yes, hello, welcome, and everything. Welcome to um, my... <laughs> welcome to the Mad Hatter's Tea Party. <laughs> oh, goodness me. So let's get into the mail, shall we? Because I have... Because I have two pieces of mail here and one I know what it is it's more goodness from true zine Rin, the amazing awesome person the the power behind sea green zines in many ways and I happened to order a little something something and I thought you know true zine Marin is de Marin not Marin <laughs> I should do, I should have my coffee before I do these videos. Anyway, True Z, I, True Z has done so much for me and I was going to order these anyway and I just thought, you know what, maybe she might like to check them out. And it just so happened that she did want to check them out. So she's been enjoying these and has now sent them along to me. Oh, here we go. Oh, <laughs> goodness. We have a note on a napkin. That is a first one. Let's see. Dear Nix, I usually forget to bring blank paper to the post office to write a note. <laughs> Here are your issues of broken pencil. Thanks for letting me do a bus stop. I have enclosed two special gifts from my pamphlet collection. Oh my, okay, cool. So very fun. <laughs> I don't think I've ever received a note on a napkin before. That's great. So yes, I ordered issues of Broken Pencil. I've been very, very interested in checking out Broken Pencil for quite a long time. And I finally just did it. Finally, finally, finally. So first up, I think what I might do is check out these lovely gifts that Shelly has sent from her pamphlet collection. Oh my, this one's completely in a language I can't read, and that's pretty cool. I want to, I want to say 
I want to say Japanese, but I'm really not sure. But anyway, what am I looking at? See, I always do this. I get to looking at the mail. I get so excited and I go, oh wait, I'm on video. <laughs> So here we go. This is the first special gift. If you know what that says, let me know. I'm very, very curious. And I apologize if it's not Japanese, if it's Chinese instead. I, uh, you know, I chose French and sign language in high school, not Jap Japanese. So sorry. But that's cool. And there's pictures of, oh, planes, various planes and everything. Oh, I'm wondering if this is about one of the world wars because there are old photos of uh, planes and whatnot. So yeah, very, 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 very curious, curious, curious. I think you might think, oh, well, you know, I can't read a thing, but um, I do like to uh, receive things in different languages and see if I can sort of figure out what's going on and what's happening What's it all about <laughs> from pictures? Of course, it doesn't help when there's no pictures. But, <laughs> but yes, that's the first special gift from Shelly. And <laughs> oh goodness, there's no, <laughs> there's no mistaking this one. Oh my goodness me. This is <laughs> a circus coloring book. <laughs> oh my goodness. I've only been to the circus once in my life and I was like, I was 20 and I went to the circus here in Australia. Well, one of them anyway. <laughs> it was really cool. But yeah, clowns still, clowns are still creepy. <laughs> yes, there we go. Cool. Well, thank you for the extras, True Zine Marin. That was very cool. But now we have the issues of Broken Pencil. Now, if you're not familiar with Broken Pencil, they are um, an organization out of Canada. I think they either run or have a very big hand in running um, Canzine, the Canzine Fest. They do a, um, a zine, zine awards sort of thing where you can send in your zine to be judged by judges, etc., etc. Um, and they also have this magazine. Now, I will get to show you. The Broken Pencil magazine. Like I said, I have been curious. Broken Pencil, the magazine of zine culture and the independent arts. Oh goodness, I want all the issues of these already. But yes, I've been interested in Broken Pencil for ages and I had so many loaded up in my cart, but you know, you know how that money stuff works. So I was only able to get a few, but someday I will have them all. <laughs> goodness but yeah it's it's really I think it's, it's a really cool thing and some people say oh zines magazines zines books and stuff like that and I think that while it's important to keep the integrity if you will of what zines are and stay true to that I think it's I still think it's really cool to when you find like um can you see <laughs> behind me this little stack but anyway um books about zines I don't and, and magazines about zines like I don't think there's anything wrong with that I think it's great I think it's to put things in these sorts of formats uh, it's a great way to introduce zines to people who might not otherwise know about zines but could greatly benefit from them because you, you know zines are awesome there's so many approaches. There's so many ways to do them. There's so, that's a, it's an all ages activity, and it can be really helpful as far as mental health goes. I I wish I'd known about zines when I was a teen. That's for sure. And I know some great people who are making zines with their kids, and it's just really brilliant. Um, I think there is a zine. Um, a mother-daughter zine that's been going for ages and the name escapes me but I'm sure you will know exactly what I'm talking about <laughs> but they have uh, the mother-daughter duo have been making zine, a zine together for ages and it's just it's super 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 brilliant and I'm actually in saying that oh <laughs> see there's there's articles there's scene reviews it's really really 
super brilliant art all kinds of stuff and um excuse me pardon me blah, 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 blah. lost my train of thought but uh, yeah i'm reminded of like um beanstalk uh uh Jess and friends making their zine, zine uh, bean stock and, and it's a regular production and stuff like that and I just think how nice would it have been to have had that when I was a kid to have those mementos of time when I was a kid I mean I'm glad that I started making my Perzine series and I'm really glad for every zine I've made really but um yeah the 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 ways that you can make things with friends and bond with friends, I think that's really beautiful too. Ooh, fun little things. Yeah, these are just so cool. <laughs> I went way back. I got a few newer ones, a few older ones. Let's see, I think this is one of the older ones. This is issue 12 when they had little subscription uh, pages right in there with the magazine and some older type um newsprint type paper very cool so yes i'm babbling on <laughs> because yes i got quite a few of these and i'm very excited and some of you may remember that i did take a little bit of time to uh not rip apart i i feel like i was trying to be i feel like i was uh <laughs> even-handed but I did uh, examine how Broken Pencil ran their first uh, zine awards but that doesn't mean that I have anything against Broken Pencil I'm really I'm excited that they do what they do I wish I could participate a bit more being a bit more involved from here in Australia I also envy the fact that they can do this and would love to do something like Broken Pencil the magazine in the future. So yes, super brilliant, awesome, not sponsored even though I've been going on for <laughs> what five minutes now about Broken Pencil. But yeah, uh, I'm just, pardon me, little cough jump cut. <laughs> Oh my goodness, yes, that's my big, big ramble. These are um, issues of Broken Pencil that I'm very excited to get into. And thank you so much to Truzine Marin for the extra surprises and for sending these along after you'd had a look. I'm glad, very glad that you enjoyed them. Oh my goodness, so much reading to do, so much reading to do. So happy. <laughs> On to the next parcel. Next up, we have some awesome goodness from Emma. Emma, all the way over in Ireland. Emma is someone I've um, internet known <laughs> for, gosh, quite a while now. Um, I don't spend nearly enough time uh, checking out their blog these days because I'm just like that. But yeah, I, gosh, how did we even internet meet I'm not sure I'm sure it was like a, a blogging thing Emma makes amazing cards ha makes amazing art does a lot of um, planner type videos and everything got into bullet journaling we all know how much I like bullet journaling <laughs> my goodness but yes when I saw the true zine Marin envelope and I saw this um, from Emma in the mail I thought yes yes this needs to happen <laughs> before Monday I cannot possibly summon up the patience Oops. <laughs> it's like a present <laughs> I cannot possibly summon up the patience within myself to wait until Monday to open this goodness because oh it's goodness it's from Emma Emma's in Ireland which I think is just super cool because you know it's one of those places you always want to travel oh goodness well wrapped my goodness me and this is a gorgeous box see I am not regretting my life choices I'm not used to recording uh, mail on Wednesdays but I'm just I'm really happy with my life choices <laughs> oh goodness don't mind my rambling so check out first first of all this gorgeous 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 box the world is yours to explore that is so lovely oh my goodness me oh 
I'm so, so glad that the shipping didn't beat this up because <laughs> I do not, do not trust Australia Post to be nice to my mail. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, okay. <laughs> the world is yours to explore. And then you open it up. And how cool is that interior? Oh, that's super brilliant. I love it. It's gorgeous. <gasps> Oh my goodness me. And we have a gorgeous card as well from Emma. Shiny, shiny. Oh, I love like that, that old map aesthetic. It's super, just, I love it. It's gorgeous. And the gold foiling. Very, very nice. Let's see what Emma has written. <laughs> Hello. Hope this surprise package finds you well. It does. Thank you and much better now for such lovely mail. Oh my goodness. I'm so excited. I see washi tape and I'm excited, but I have to read the note first. <laughs> Consider it a late birthday, early Christmas present. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. Oh my. I've been doing a lot of reorganizing. Oh my goodness. It, it, I swear it's, <laughs> I, oh, this is going to sound like bragging, but it's not but I have friends from all over the world and it's it's strange how things like ripple through one friend will mention they're reorganizing and then another men friend will mention and then another friend and and or one friend will have a bad week and another friend it just things just ripple through it's amazing <laughs> so sorry. you're not the only one organizing Emma <laughs> Oh, let's see. I have been doing a lot of reorganizing and trying to make space for my new stationery along with continuing to get subscription boxes. <laughs> Don't doesn't go well subscription boxes and trying to make space. Oh, I can imagine. <laughs> so I'm trying to find good homes for all the stuff that's still usable. Hope you can put these pins, patches and washi, washi tape to use. Take care, Emma. Oh my goodness. Thank you, Emma. Oh, thank you for thinking of me. That's so, oh, that's so lovely. Yes, I will always provide a home for for the washi tape and the other goodness. And oh my, and, and ooh, I do love. <laughs> How pretty is that blue? Ooh, love it, love it, love it, love it. Oh my goodness. So Emma has sent lots of amazing goodness and i'm just oh i'm over the moon oh my goodness so i'll just empty out the box here oh sorry <laughs> i'm getting excited maybe i should have just <laughs> sorry i am babbling but i am also so glad that i get to do this today because this is really such a great way to start the day and how great is this box like i think oh gosh there's so many ways I can use this. Whoops, bump the mic. Bump the mic because you're so excited. But yes, there's so many ways I can use this. And I'm very, very happy. Ooh. So we have super cute, awesome, sweet, lovely prezzies from Emma because Emma is awesome. Made of awesome is awesome through and through. Awesome all the way from Ireland. And first stop in a fun yellow bulldog clip. I don't know what other people call them. I've, I've always, these have always been just big bulldog clips. We have tons of journal cards. Oh, and these are so useful because they're good in scrapbooking. They're good in journaling. They're good. You can cut out the various elements and use those elements on cards and all sorts of goodness. So it's Saturday, it'll be good for journaling. Oh, thank you, Emma. Thank you, thank you. This is such a, like, such an unexpected surprise. I'm so happy. Oh, the, y'all are the best. All of you, you're the best, I tell you. Like, <laughs> I don't know what good I did, but I am, I'm just, <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I did enough good to deserve all of this wonder and wonderfulness. <laughs> and next up we... <laughs> oh, this is great. Next up we have a very fun pin from Oh Dear. Dear being D-W-E-R and it is a pretzel. It is a shiny gold pretzel and I love it. That's cute. That is just cute very 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 cute <laughs> and of course oh it's 
a great day when you have post-it notes. Oh my goodness. I love post-it notes almost as much as I love washi. Almost. Sorry. The 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 shiny um the cello wrapping <laughs> is making it a bit difficult to for the camera to focus, but you can see at least that it, it's uh, excuse me, it's a polar bear and it's super cute because I'm just looking on the back here and it looks like you can use it as a bookmark. Kind of like have the bear stick out of the pages, stick it in your keyboard, all that sorts of sort of thing. And oh, that's really brilliant! Oh my goodness! <laughs> and then we have <laughs> a very fun patch. Oh my goodness! Oh, cool, cool, cool! <laughs> a very fun patch from Paper Gang. It says, "Hi, I'm Drew. I'm the leader of." of the paper gang. I'm an iron-on patch to make your membership official. Ooh, very cool. How fun does that look? Awesome, awesome, awesome. Cool. Love it. Love it. And then we have another patch that is super cute. Super, super, super adorable. Oh my goodness. I'm going to have to get like a jacket or something because I have a few patches now and I would love to like make it official rather than just you know keeping my patches here there like have a <laughs> maybe I'll put a like a what am I thinking of a hook or something and I'll have a jacket and then I can just iron on all the, <laughs> the patches onto the jacket and, and hang it within view but what am I looking at I'm looking at this super cute bunny how adorable is that so gorgeous so lovely oh bunny 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 <laughs> Oh, that's so cute. And then we have the washi tape. And not only is the washi tape itself awesome, the washi tape comes in this super cool container. It's here and then you just open her up. And there we go. And then you have that and that. How cool is that? That's like, that's like ultimate washi travel stuff washi travel hack <laughs> travel with your washi hack that's so cool and you just boop and then you're oh my goodness i can't believe you sent the container too that's amazing thank you <laughs> and because it's washi tape we need to have the close-ups of the awesomeness of the tape <laughs> and here we have some interesting like uh, Native American maybe Mex some Mexican sort of aesthetic here and let's see I'm just going to move forward and hope <laughs> I'm so sorry I'm so sorry for shaking hands and for um, doesn't want to okay there we go ignore my hands and just focus on the goodness of the washi so we have that one and we have ooh, planets in space super cute <laughs> I see planets in space stuff now I'm like I'm immediately reminded of Vladibule <laughs> who is amazing and you should check out her art if you uh, haven't already and this one's a little bit dark but there's some planets and little spaceships and stuff and then we have bears bears and bear tracks and binoculars super cute oh i wish i could get closer and it would still focus because that is just adorable but you can kind of make out there that <laughs> there's bears and things <laughs> super cute and then we have oh cutie more cute it's all super cute we have oh my goodness holding the white up white paper up certainly makes the back dark um <laughs> we have very cute squirrels with their with their mouths full of the acorns <laughs> and then we have hooray celebrate yolo fun all kinds of shiny foil goodness excitement <laughs> yolo <laughs> Oh, so cool, so cool. And then finally we have an under the sea silver foil goodness here. Very shiny, very cool. I hope you can make it out in the video. Got 
fish and seaweed. Oh, it's so cool. Oh, it's all so cool. And I just, I'm gobsmacked and, and it is. It's birthday and Christmas all in one. Oh, I cannot. I'm just really struggling to get over the awesomeness of <laughs> this container that's so brilliant. Oh my goodness, I'm so taking washi everywhere. <laughs> That is just, oh, and the, it's so easy. It's so easy to use. Oh, that is so, it's all so cool. Thank you, Emma. Thank you. This is such, such a lovely surprise. And Emma, you are such a lovely person, especially with <laughs> how late I am in sending pretty much anything and everything. <laughs> I'm ashamed to say, oh. <laughs> Anyway, thank you so much to Emma and thank you so much to Truzine Marin. It has been a wonderful day of wonderful surprises and I <laughs> like I said, I must have been must have done something very good in the last life because I have not done nearly enough in this life to <laughs> to deserve the amazing wonderful things that landed my post box. This is just I'm so happy. <laughs> <laughs> oh goodness me I better I had better wrap it up or else I'll just sit here and babble all morning about how amazing you all are because I could just do that I could I could probably just make a video and be like hey hi you're awesome did you know you're awesome because you you you're awesome and it'll be some sort of <laughs> motivational video or something not motivational just feel good because you should feel good because you have spread sunshine in my life and for that I am infinitely grateful to all of you to True Zimmerin, to Emma to everyone who likes these videos who, who watches who subscribes whatever it is you do or how you do it I don't I don't want to feel yicky and say, oh, subscribe, and nothing against people who do. It just makes me feel kind of, you know, you know how to work YouTube. <laughs> y'all, you're watching, and you all know how to work YouTube. So if you want to do the things, do the things. I greatly appreciate it. But if you don't want to, that's okay, because I'm just some mad lady in Australia opening mail and talking about scenes, so... <laughs> <laughs> and I've babbled a lot. See, I wasn't going to babble. I said I, I've babbled about not babbling. <laughs> oh my goodness me. I will wrap it up here and say one more thank you to each and every one of you for doing all of the things that you do. Thank you so much. You, you, you truly brighten my life. You give, <laughs> you give my days purpose and happiness and I can never repay that joy. So thank you all so much and until next time make some zines send some mail and spread a little sunshine Mwah. really i'm just i'm so happy i'm so happy you you, you all are the best and <laughs>